can see nice and resinous. Hey guys, Bearded CB82 here. So today I uh, got a really special mail call, um, and well, it's a double mail call. This one's gonna be going up on both channels, the outdoor channel and the tool channel. Uh, basically, um, well, one of the things I I got in uh, was this guy, Off Grid Tools, and uh, I, it was kind of a YouTube giveaway uh, a little while back did a uh, Mission 22 fundraiser, and it was led by MD Outdoors. Um, some of you guys may know him, some of you guys might not. I'm gonna put a link to the description box down below, but uh, pretty much we held a raffle. A lot of people donated a lot of things, and um, those stuff got sent out. And this was uh, the thing that, damn air compressor, I tell you, every time. Uh, this was the thing that I won. Uh, it's the Survival X Elite by Off Grid Tools, and this thing is awesome. But um, as you can see, I've been uh, using it a little bit. I should have got it on camera when I was using it, especially uh, the Sawzall there. And I might take out another Sawzall blade with me to try out with this because it does, you know, just do the Sawzall thing. So no big thing there uh, swap that out real easy but uh, mission 22 for those of you who don't know is a nonprofit organization dedicated to helping veterans and military members with PTSD uh, similar to Justin's final mission uh, basically it's yeah 22 veterans a day commit suicide and uh, I wish they would have had programs like that, um, you know, way back when I was uh, still on active duty even, you know, you lose a few friends that you wouldn't think you ever would lose and, you know, shit's not easy on a lot of people. Um, but they are completely non-profit, it's literally like 97 cents out of every dollar that gets donated to them goes directly towards their programs. It's only like four or five cents on every dollar actually goes to the administration fees, keeping their website going, all the other stuff. And But everything else is for helping out people that really do need it. Is not have any veterans a day committing suicide. But a lot of you have heard about how great, you know, VA healthcare might be. Um, and of course, I'm being sarcastic on that one. Uh, having other programs that are out there by military members for veterans and military members to help them out in any way shape or form it's an awesome deal I'm gonna put a link down below to uh, MD Outdoors and uh, also gonna put a link down below to Mission 22 you can find their mission statement um, every so often I do try to donate when I can um, I will be doing another tool review on this guy of course because uh, it uh, went through some paces the other day uh, collecting fat wood. I don't know if you, can, uh, you can't see that one too well. But it will do good on sizes up to this. I think this one was cut with the Zubat though. Um, anything over this just with the blade that's on it, trying to saw through there takes a little bit. But for uh, sizes like this, which is about an inch and three quarters around, uh, works really good on so I still got a bucket of it here I get to cross it now next thing great American survival um, out of Georgia another youtuber I'm gonna put a link down below to his channel uh, somehow he got a hold of my address I had no clue this was coming at all 
And so we're going to take the uh, Sogzilla here from my good buddy Plumpy E, who could really use a few prayers right now. He's got a lot going on over it with his family. But um, see what we got from Great American Survival. Uh, kind of knew about the guy, other stuff. Um, I thought I had been subscribed to him on my outdoor channel. Apparently I wasn't. But um, so somehow I got something from him. So first thing, hey, I got some of his stickers. Great American Survival. You know, be prepared and stay safe. Got a couple of those. Let's see here. Ah, his cafe means I think it's upside down. Holy crap. I did open it upside down. Alright, so what do we got here? Jesus. Um Coffee, 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 and um, I think that's a candle, a uh, homemade outdoor candle of some sort. Um, let's see here, so I got coffee there, French vanilla cappuccino, I got a couple of coffees, a few of coffees, uh, more French vanilla cappuccino, uh, Miss Cafe Blend and Brew, this is actually a pretty good sized one, uh, chocolate, I don't know, chocolate chocolate, hot chocolate, I think this is hot chocolate, um, uh, biscotti that kind of got crumpled up, but don't worry, it's still good. And I think that is a homemade candle. A little bitty survival candle. And it all came in the cup from Great American Survival. Really nice cup. So, one of the enamel wear. So, but, yep. Um, hope you guys enjoy. If you guys see it pop up twice on the double feed, uh, don't worry. I, I'll, I won't take offense if you only watch once. But, um, good because going outdoors on Sunday. Uh, maybe grab some more, um, that would too, maybe. Try to get some fishing done. But, um, go check out the channels down below as I knock the tripod. Um, by all means, Check him out, uh, especially uh, MD Outdoors. A couple times each year, he tries to do uh, the fundraiser for for Mission 22. Um, you know, very very few programs out there that are really good like that. Uh, especially on the nonprofit side, a lot of people are more aware of say. Uh, uh, Wounded Warrior Project, which is a good project. They do try to do a lot of stuff, but they are a for-profit organization. They get the word out, but they are also a huge for-profit organization versus Mission 22, which is not. So, anyways, guys, um, there you go. Um, hope you all have a really good weekend, and y'all take care. Thanks.